Senator Blunt. Uh, thank you, Senator Boxer, and thanks to you and Senator Inhofe for holding this hearing. Uh, yesterday, October the 16th, uh, the Corps announced that the Missouri River flood was officially over. Now, we've had lots of flooding in our state over the years, and usually it's uh, a few days or a few weeks in April or May. October the 16th, the Corps announced that the flood was officially over. This was a flood that uh, started in Senator Baca's state uh, over five months ago. Uh, five months of flooding. In Missouri, we had, uh, we had uh, significant amounts of the state that were underwater for three and four months. Uh, and while no disaster response is perfect, uh, it's certainly important to learn from the past. And I think, as Senator Thune has just mentioned, failing to account uh, for disaster events or mistakes and dismissing disasters as unlikely to occur again uh, simply isn't good enough. Uh, over the past year, Missouri and the entire country have faced a number of natural disasters that claim many lives and devastated the livelihoods of people in our communities. Uh, as we work to rebuild, uh, there's a lot to be done. Ke uh, Colonel Anthony Hoffman, uh, the Kansas City Corps commander, uh, said again yesterday as he was calling an official end to the flood uh, that the Corps has $27.7 million set aside for repairs. At a hearing last week, Senator Landrieu called. The Corps said they needed $1 billion uh, for, uh, to bring uh, the river management system back to where it was at the beginning of this year. So we have $27 million set aside. We need $1 billion, not to get the system better than it was in January, but just to get the system uh, back to where it was in January. And of course, um, as we look at that, we see counties like Holt County, Missouri, where uh, 165,000 acres was underwater for most of the summer. Uh, Birds Point, water went in when that floodway was open and went back out. It was 130,000 acres, uh, not nearly as impacted as the 165,000 acres uh, in Holt County. I was there recently. They were able to get miraculously a crop in, even though there was lots of early crop uh, loss. But overall, we had over 400,000 acres uh, underwater at some time this year. That's about half the size of the entire state of Rhode Island. And a lot of that 400,000 acres was underwater for three and four months. Uh, and uh, we haven't ever seen anything like that before. As um, one county commissioner, I think, well said about the impact of these floods, uh, which took out interstate highways, county roads, state roads, uh, at one time five bridges over the Missouri River, uh, where Missouri is on one side of the bridge, were closed. Uh, and as a county commissioner talked about all the jobs impacted, he just simply said the factory doesn't get back to work until the roads are rebuilt. The roads aren't rebuilt until the flood protection is restored, and the flood protection is not restored until Congress provides the funding. And so thanks for holding this hearing. Uh, I have a statement for the record, and I will submit it.